Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of the Decades Challenge. And I want to welcome all of my new pair of bears to another episode. So, guys, yeah, um, at the end of the last episode, I don't know what happened. I think my game glitched out and made Jack older than he actually is. And because I still don't know how I'm meant to be able to bring back Sims, because, you know, Jack is a Sim. Even if he is just a dog, he's still a part of the family. But, yeah, as you can see, you can see Grim Reaper behind us. Yeah. Jack died. He died. Of old age, apparently. Because, you know, he wasn't that old, okay? So I just don't know how this happened. I don't know how to fix it. Um, because their grief is real. The only person that I'm not out here, of course, is Charles Jr. because he's still inside. See thing. He is still just He's still just a brat, okay? I'm sorry, he's still a brat. Okay, so I don't know what to do. Jack has died. Um Caroline is absolutely devastated. She's mourning her pet. And be remembering a pet that passed away, she is devastated and I just don't know how to fix it for her. So the only thing I can think of is I'm going to get her to give John a bath and then we're going to have the kids get themselves sorted because they do start school tomorrow. Primary school is a mandatory. They have to do it. Um, how's that girl doing? She's okay. She's just missing Jack. I, I don't know what to do, guys, but I don't want to use any cheats or anything to make this game less traumatic, and it's just the way things are. So for now, I just have to make sure our kiddos are doing okay, and that, um, that's all I can do, guys, that's all I can do. So, I'm going to have them, after they sort themselves out, Caroline is going to make some food. We're going to have a Sunday kind of meal. Okay, I'm going to have her cook. So we're going to pretend Charles went out and uh, I think there's a roast chicken in this. I can't remember. We're probably not added yet. Okay, we're going to have her do camper stew. Okay, it's the best thing I can think of right now. So she's going to do a stew and we're just going to have kiddos. <clears throat> well, he's an apple. I don't know why he has an apple. Can we plant an apple tree? Yeah, we're going to plant an apple tree for Jack. Okay. Oh, no. In the presence of death. Charles, you're going to have to come here and do this for me, please. <laughs> I'm so sad. Everything has to be watered. We got some cherry trees. I'm gonna have the little guy come inside and play it with the dollhouse for now. Um, just to uh, hopefully just to kind of break it out now. Uh, ask Charles for food. Change clothes, go potty. You know what? You're not having a tablet. <clears throat> oh, you can't go potty. Charles, can you please come plant the flowers at the front? Thank you. <clears throat> Charles did no work today. Is it morning time? It is. We all. <clears throat> Our beautiful girl, she really needs to go to the bathroom. Okay. I'm going to have Charles Jr. go and fish because it just tends to kind of help him. You know, look, look at this, like, festering bitterness. I, that, that, oh, just go fishing, please, dude. He's grounded. He's not allowed to leave home. She's gonna. I thought it was actually night time. Didn't realize it was 8 a.m. So I'm just gonna have her pack it into a sack, lunch, pack it in the fridge. <coughs> she's 
Julie. I think we could actually have the kids go and play on the pirate ship. Oh no, he'd get grounded if he left the home. Okay. So Charles is uh, busy at work, so we're going to have him start doing everything now. <clears throat> okay. So you know, Charles is going to go out and start doing all the gardening and just grabbing everything that we can to sell. Um, oh, I'm going to have Caroline come and feed the cow plant because... Um, um, can you name this little guy as well? This is for the 1900s, so we're just going to name it the 1900s. Okay. <clears throat> Freaking love the decade challenge. It's every 10 years in sim life, it's actually a whole child's adult. But right up until adulthood. They can get married as teenagers because there's a mod for it. And I think it's with MC Command Center. So we can figure it out that way. And um, when Charles is done, we're going to have to get him to wheel everything. Um, there we go. And he's gonna have to. Alright, there's nothing to sell, is there? They're in season. Alright, it's because it's so early that nothing's popped up yet. Is that it? Or, you know, this is better. Just click tend to the garden. Go. There. And then we'll have him working hard. Who's that? Uh, uh, stop, stop. Go in and play dolls. And there we go. Right, I'm gonna need Charles then to tend to the chickens. Okay. You're doing good. Let's actually have a look at this little boy's skills. Okay, he's doing awesome. He needs to have a pie, though. Where's Caroline? Oh, we have a baby! Oh my god, I forgot we had a baby! How freaking silly am I? Um, shush, baby. Well, the festival you has started, and kids grab paper cup with this art. Oh, we can't. Get involved with any of them. There, baby's okay now. <sighs> I'm gonna have her knit some stuff. And then we're gonna have her doing mummy duties, which is potty training and stuff. Where's our girl? Alright, she's over here. Can she. Alright, no, she can't do anything this way. Nope. Okay. I'd love for the kids to meet, make friends, but they won't make them until they go to school. That man is hungry. Thomas Jebera. Open. Baby's crying again. Speed. Let baby go eat. Baby's gonna go eat. Aren't you? Okay, there we go. Mommy's feeding baby. Charles is dealing with the farm stuff. Awesome. Evolve. I like it when we have plants to evolve. So this is going to be something like he's thinking about in the long run. He'd like to pass this down to his family. But Charles Jr. is going to have like a different plan altogether. He's going to want to go off and make a name for himself. Um, Laura Beth, if she has to get married, we'll have to... She'll stay obviously on the land. So what we can do is it can be handed down to the last. Look, oh, we've got little Mary as well. All right. Can we not... 
Right, and mushrooms. Okay, he's still sad about Jack. This guy, I don't know what we're going to do. He's always stressed. Look for frogs as well. I'm going to give you a break from this. All the cows and everything are just looking at him as in like, why are you so moody? You are free. You can do as you please. You keep looking for the frogs, okay? You're catching these frogs. Uh, go on a vacation to Granite Falls. No, 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 no. Nope. Okay, take a mud bath. Okay. Um, we got a frog. Okay, she's doing okay now. She's happy. She's calm and collected. She's going to clean up after her mum. And she's going to come here and she's going to parent, help with the needs, tell them to eat something. Ah, oh, no, 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 you little cracker muffin. Discipline firmly. And she's going to help with the cleaning up and mopping up any puddles. She's given her mum a break. Okay. And then this can be put in here. Dude, don't slam the fridge. Alright, you need just, just go chill. Just go chill in the bath. Okay, go take yourself a mud, a mud bath. Okay. And then our girl is going to come back here and she's going to help her mum. Now, and he's getting his bath. Charles, what are you at, my dear? You're still doing the gardening and stuff. When you're done, I'm going to have you come and you're going to make something. I don't know what we're going to make. Another chair. Oh. That makes me really sad. Oh, God love her, guys. God love her. Jack. I just think like you're going to be in this yard forever because Caroline needs you in this yard. With his bowl, right, we're going to have her empty the bowl though. Okay, the lemons are starting to come up as he's gardening, so we're going to have him super selling the lemons. And do the, all of this other stuff as well. Uh, tent the garden and weed everything. I'm just keeping him busy. I know it's bad, but we have to kind of do it. Oh, Caroline, this little, oh, discipline, strictly, and we're going to have to yell this time because he just, he's not learning, um, no, uh, we're just going to have her sit, get some more clothing, so we can make a baby onesie, let's do the green and red. Okay. She's so sad. Okay. Um he needs a nap though. Like so we're just gonna have him go take a nap. There we go. Two common upgrade parts, that's good. Charles, I really need you to go out and weed. Thank you. Why can't we pick the mushrooms? It won't allow us. Oh well. Do as we told. We'll do as we told. Okay, cow plant needs to be fed again. All these here need to be super sold. And do I have... Got something to upgrade. Well, evolve. Oh. 
who yeah, 1900, so four called 1900. Alright, one of my trees need to be involved and I can't find the tree. Mm. Okay, well. <gasps> what happened? What happened? He shrunk. Why? Glitch game. Glitchy freaking game. Oh, freaking heck. Okay, change your diaper. This game is glitching out like there's no tomorrow today. I'm seriously getting annoyed. Can you just go here and just go away from the baby? Go away from the baby. Please. Alright, what's wrong with this kid? You've eaten. Okay, I'm getting so distracted by everything else. I'm just not, I'm, I'm losing the plot now. Alright, here. Alright, everybody, just come and grab some food. You come and grab a serving of this, okay? Um, you really need to go to the bathroom. Okay, um... No tantrums. Forget your tantrums. No, no, no. Can you please come, go to the bathroom and come for some food? Come for some food. Why are you fine? Tap bath then. No. He was back asleep. Karen's gonna go. John is very hungry. Be sure to feed him. John, I've got food on the counter for you. Please go take it. Is this camper stew? Franks and beans. Okay, they're all going to fart. It's okay. Right, what else do we need to do? We've got our cow plants planted for the next gen. Um, one shrank back down. He's no more than a head. So that's annoying. Ugh, a tree is just gone. Uh, can you please just go to the toilet? Right, dispose of dead plant. Okay. He is very uncomfortable. Why aren't you in? Oh, for the love of freaking! All right, we need to get uh, like um an outdoor wee bush as well because. Kids are driving me insane. Let's get one about here. There we go. No, no. Uh, fertilize this bush, please. He says. Flora. Hi, Flora. I would like my daughter to make a friend, and you look like the perfect girl for her to make a friend with. No, okay. I'll go to the wee bush. Plus, stop, stop walking. Thank you. Oh my god, seriously. Fertilize the frickin' bush. What is wrong with this goddamn game today? I think I'm just going to have her go to sleep because this game is glitching out. To sleep. You are going to go to sleep now. You need to go to sleep because you're being a little sh... Flash. Sleep. Okay. Where is she? She's there. Okay. Everyone... It's just got to go to sleep now, and we're going to pick it back up in the morning. Everyone's awake at 3.07 in the morning, and it actually looks like it's getting bright outside, which is weird. Where's the moon? Where's the moon? 
that's a cute over there, like that. I don't know where the moon is, but hey. But everyone's awake, and it's annoying me. Okay, so. Oh, he wants his diaper change, and Daddy's doing it. Yay! That means Mom has time to get up and check in on the other kids. Um, influence her to go back to sleep. Um, can we pop this little boy back into bed? Um, toddler care. Put to bed. Dad, you need to go back to sleep because you got to get up early. You've got up so get up soon. So you do. Pull the fan back to bed. Hmm. Read him to sleep. And then before you head back to sleep, my little woman, you can. Alright, where's Laura Beth? Did Laura Beth go back to bed? Laura Beth, chat with her mum. Okay, well, I suppose you're up, aren't you? you? You seem fine. You have school today. You could be excited about your first day at school. Let's get you all dressed. Are you dressed? I don't know. I don't think that's your outfit. Okay, now you're dressed. So get yourself all sorted for a nice, a wonderful day at first school. Okay, man here, you need to get up. Okay, they start things early around here, so we should be doing stuff like this. Okay. Uh, you are going to get yourself a glass of blue milk? A glass of milk, okay. That's like frozen. Are you frozen? You are frozen. That was very cute though. But you go on back to sleep. Good boy. Mom's gonna go out and get some more sleep before. Okay. Oh, look at her. Isn't she just a gem, guys? I wish we had a book for her. Wait, we can get her a book. We can get her to read something. Okay. Charles, it's time for you to get up. Um. Get yourself a coffee or a cup of tea or something. Let's see what we've got. Chips, no. Mm. No. Get some yogurt. And then you have to get back to work. You have to get back to work. Get sell all. Right, what have we got to do today? Okay, super sell. Ooh, we have some carrots. Okay, uh, super sell. Let's get started on our super cells. Okay, this guy I think needs to be fed. I don't know. How do we fix this? There we go, you're back. <sighs> yeah, okay. Cat fat needs to be fed. You are a week, so long have you feed the cow plant for us. Still mourning our lovely Jack. Water this little guy as well. Okay. Charles is up. Charles is going to be super selling. He's going to be washing everything. He's going to be be weeding everything. <laughs> Let's get this going. I'm gonna have our girl here doing stuff. All right, one of these trees is dead, but it's not telling me which one. Is it this one? No. Um, this one. Yeah, this was the dead plant. She can help with the weeding as well because the kids are all sorted. Okay, 
Charles, how are you doing? Oh, yay, yay. Okay, first day of school for the wonderful, wonderful. Um, I didn't sign up the little ad for preschool. No, it's good. They didn't have preschool back then. Um, he's doing fine. These are looking good. These are looking so good. We're making so much money these days, guys. It's unreal. We could have her selling all the mushrooms and definitely helping with all of the weeding. Okay, Charles just sold everything. It's cool, like the two of them can be like a double team and they can just kind of get everything done together. All right, while they're doing that, I want to go see and make sure the kids are ready for school. Oh, you're awesome, dude. Um, Laura Beth is so ready for school. Um, she's going to help her mum. We'll have Charles Jr. Oh, he can't repair that. Mum can repair it. Are right, the kids going to school? <gasps> They're off to school, yes, oh my god, yes, okay, have a good day in school, kids. Okay, you're going to listen to the teacher. And listen to the teacher. Although, no, we can have him kind of slacking off a little bit because um, he can make friends. Oh, Charles, you're going to have to go and read. And you have to go do a baby. Okay, shush baby. Recipe baby. Good one. There you go. I think it's baby's birthday tomorrow. Yeah. Mary is aging up tomorrow. Charles is doing okay. That's good, good, good. Alright, no, dude, you're not done. You are so not done. You are so not done. You have to supercell all of the lemons. Everything has to get supercelled. I do not care. Met Louise while at school. Awesome. Supercell. Okay. This needs to be thrown away. Okay, there you go. No. Uh oh. Okay. Uh, he should have clean. Okay. You can do these flowers, my dear. Let's change the diaper. Little John, what are you, Ash? He's wetting his diaper. Okay. okay. Fast forward a little bit. Right, you're done now, please. Go and deal with the baby. I hope the kids do good in school today. I'm going to switch that up now to listen to teacher. And I'm going to have her make some friends. Okay, he's happy. We've made a lot of money. He still hasn't done all of this stuff, so let's go super sell everything, please. These were watered. What are these as well? Oh, it's so cute. Okay, so enough of that now, Caroline. You got a potty train, John. And then you're going to have to give him a bubble bath. I'd love to drag that inside, actually. Can we bring that inside? It's a bathtub. Like in front of the fire here. I've seen this a lot. Um, they drag the yolk in and they have their little bubble baths in front of the fireplace. There we go. Okay. And Charles is doing a pretty good job. Okay, we have a lot of these yolks we can sell. Laura Beth also met Louise in school. Okay. 
Okay, alright, okay. I know not a lot has happened in this episode, but it's the Decades Challenge, guys, and it's not one of those games that we can rush. We gotta take our times, and we gotta do this right. Okay, so they are making very big headways in the the financial side of it. They've got lots of kids, and um, they can have two more kids. So I actually am going to allow them to have a full house because I love kids, absolutely love kids. So I am actually going to end the episode here on these very, very cute vibes of um, Caroline giving little John his bubble bath. Um, I will try and remember where I got this um, this custom content from. But for now, guys, I want to thank you for joining me, and I hope you have an absolutely amazing Tuesday. And I shall see you guys in another episode. Bye!